welcome back again uh, today uh, we will continue our new topic uh, mv switch gear uh, mv is for medium voltage uh, switch gear system so we will see how it looked like i will give you a pictorial view first of all this is how the medium voltage switch gear if you go to substation will be look like it's uh, it's like a compartments in this uh, a single panel here you can see uh, it consists of a complete system like this is a protection uh, installed in it control is installed downside uh, uh, indication and measurements are installed here even energy meters can be installed also here uh, in the in the inside uh, I will show you later in the cutout that uh, how the switch gear itself like uh, ice, um, breaker uh, CT which is installed in it uh, the isolator is not installed in it but rather than isolator function is taking out by wrecking the trolley out so here downside uh, you can open it and then you can wreck out the trolley which is provide isolation purpose of isolation so wrecked out means it is uh, uh, outside and it is physically separated from the main circuit so if you want to do some maintenance you can do it okay here this uh, is the uh, uh, cutout as i told you how a, a medium voltage cubicle compartment look like uh, okay here we can see uh, this is an relay okay you can see here this is uh, low control lv low voltage control cabinet in this one you have all the auxiliary relays are installed here main relay is installed here this one is test plug facility this is another test plug facility and, the, and uh, this is the mimic uh, which is showing the position of isolator and breaker down there you can see this is the circuit breaker trolley uh, it can be racked out and racked in as I uh, told you before uh, this is the basically bus power which is running between the panels which is common between the panels uh, this is the current transformer uh, it is installed uh, in series of the circuit these are cable connections which going uh, it can be incoming and outgoing cables uh, this is the voltage transformer which is installed downside so this compartment if you open it you can access the voltage transformer so this is how the MV panel look like So we will move to uh, okay I will show you now the single line diagram in which you can see how the MV panels are connected in a system okay hi, uh, what I have done here you can see the uh, this is 132 by 11 kV uh, uh, transformer which is converting 132 kV to 11 kV or 12 kV so this is a delta star transformer the output of this one is connected to feeder k5 basically this is the uh, it is called an uh, incomer transformer uh, because its power is coming in to the bus power okay so this transformer is uh, uh, this uh, switch gear is k5 this is the symbol of uh, breaker q0 these double signs these are showing uh, the uh, isolation mechanism through racking in or racking out this is the symbol of ct this is another ct okay here you can see this is the incomer this is the common bus bar that we have seen before this bus bar is 3000 and uh, ampere and 11 kV rated and we have various output feeders we have four output feeders k1 k2 k3 and k4 k4 is again through the breaker then we have a ct disconnected to uh, auxiliary transformer which is supplying power to the local grid we have two outgoing feeders k2 and k3 we have another feeder at mv which is connected to the 11 kV capacitor bank so this is some introduction of the um, MV how it's look like in single di line diagram mm, thank you